So I'm Linda Chapman and this is Lee Weatherly and we're here to tell you about our new series Sophie and the Shadow Woods that we've written together. Uh, Lee and I have been friends for quite a long time and we always read each other's other work and talk about our story ideas and we just thought it would be so much fun to actually write a series half and half, have both our names on it and be able to do it completely together. So Lee's going to tell you a little bit about what the series is about. It's um, out in May and there'll be six books. It's called Sophie in the Shadow Woods, and it's about a girl called Sophie who, on her 10th birthday, finds out that she has an amazing secret that she had had no idea of. And that is that she is the guardian of a place called the Shadow Woods. Uh, the Shadow Woods are right beside her house, and it turns out that they're the gateway to the Shadow Realm, where the horrible shadow creatures live. And Sophie is the only person who can stop them from invading our world. Yeah, they mustn't open the gateway because the shadow realm is full of horrible creatures like boggarts and trolls and imps. And if they actually, if the gateway ever opens, they'll all come crowding in and chaos will happen. So Sophie, as Lee said, is the one person who can save the world. Well, okay. Sophie is very pretty. She's got lots of long blonde hair, but she's a complete tomboy. So she loves taekwondo, which is a bit like kickboxing. Uh, and she's very physical. She loves football as well. And she wants to be a stuntswoman when she grows up. Her best friend is a boy called Sam, and they've been best friends for ages, and Sam's quite clever. Um, there are loads of characters in the book, some really fun ones. Yeah. Who's your favourite, Lee? I think one of my favourites has to be Ugg, the King of the Goblins. Mm. Um, he's such a fun character to write about and to read about, if it's a scene that you wrote. Um, he's vain, and he's arrogant, and he's very cowardly, and uh, he thinks that he's just the most amazing thing in the world. Deep in the heart of Shadow Woods, Ugg the Goblin hurried through the trees. His head was toadstool-shaped, and brown rags covered his knobbly body. His snowy white skin was flaking and tinged black at the edges. He chortled, hardly believing his luck. He had done it. He'd got the key. After all these years of watching and waiting, and he hadn't even had to go near the house. Those two stupid children had practically given the key to him, leaving it sitting right where he could take it. Dimwits, numbskulls, worm brains, the lot of them. So he's a great character. Oh, yes. And uh, there's all the different shadow creatures as well, which are fun characters. Yeah, all the different bad creatures. Yeah. But we'll tell you about those another time.